About a month ago, on a very hot summer day, I stood on a stage in a house at. I traveled there to meet Chief McQuinna. I traveled there to meet his community, and they honored me with a name. Chuchuma. Chuchuma. And it's the name of one of his female ancestors. And for me, that was an incredibly moving and very profoundly meaningful gesture. Because not only did I receive a name that meant so much to Chief McQuinna, that was a part of his history, but as I stood on that stage on that sunny day, I saw the sun beaming down and illuminating the beaches of the islands around us, and I imagined that one of those beaches was the beach where my grandfather was born in 1899. He was born to a very poor mother. And when he was born, there is no doubt in my mind that his safe delivery was assisted by a woman, an Achalnath woman, who was specialized in midwifery. And no doubt in my mind that his brothers had an equally safe entry into the world because of an Ahousit midwife who made sure they came into the world safe. And then I thought about my grandfather, who was the third non-Aboriginal birth registered in the region in 1899, and how he and his brothers, Charlie and Eddie, learned how to fish and make their living up and down the coast. And I had no doubt that they learned about the waters and where the fish were going to be found from people of the Nichalnath Nation. They showed them how to make a living. And then I had no doubt that on those perilous seas on the west coast of Vancouver Island, that their lives would have undoubtedly been saved by their fellow fishermen, some of whom were Nichalnath people. And what I remembered when I thought about all that, and it all went through my mind with the blanket on me, with McKenna beside me, I realized that the Ahouset, the Nichalnath, could have very easily done without my family being there. But my family could never have survived without the Ahouset. And when I received my name from Chief McQuinna, that is why it had a very special meaning. Because it was part of his history, but it also helped me discover my history and what we shared, and why together our histories and how our histories have been shaped.